The theory of self-transcendence was created by Pamela Reed. The theory proposes that people's capacity for self-transcendence is activated when they face life-threatening illness or undergo health-related changes that intensify awareness or vulnerability or mortality. This increases in self-transcendence is evident in expansion of self-boundaries in ways that foster well-being. So by facing life-threatening events, it reflects on our well-being through self-reflection. Definitions for the self-transcendence theory include person, human being developed through life events and environments, nursing, assistance through interpersonal process and therapeutic management of environments to promote health, health, sense of feeling whole and healthy according to one's own criteria for wholeness and health, environment, family, social networks, physical surroundings, and community resources. In this scenario, we have an older gentleman who was a professional soccer player in his youth. In recent months, he has been losing his balance and had several near-fall experiences, yet he appears to be in denial about his ability to walk without assistance. He insists on being, quote, independent. Concerned after receiving no answers to her phone calls, his daughter goes to his home. Damn. What happened? I fell. Take this in. Take this in. Okay. I've been here for hours. After being admitted to rehab for his fractured hip, the patient was reluctant to accept any form of help or walking device assistance. It was not until Nurse Brian stepped in to talk to the patient that the patient became willing to accept help. Nurse Brian's father went through an almost identical experience. He had personally been a witness to this process before and wanted to help this patient progress forward in his life fully yet safely. This patient was not originally assigned to the nurse but he felt the need to answer his call to nursing by going above and beyond the standard practice of care. He focused on identifying the needs of this patient and finding ways to help the patient accept that he can still have independence in life just in a new way. The patient is able to transcend his sense of self in this difficult period of life. Realizing his limitations allows him to mature to a new place in life, adapting to his circumstances. Two ways principle of holistic nursing were applied. Person coming to accept life change and development. Environment helping holistic nurse, familial support, system like the daughter or any other support group. The couple's way of knowing of the situation or personal knowing uh, the nurse's father went through a similar situation, was great in profession, and had to admit some limitation. And now, nurse is able to help this patient adopt a new lifestyle. Thank you.